Emma Navarro versus Paola Bedosa is the first quarter final for the ladies US Open for 2024. And both players have had great runs to get to this stage. Bedosa entered the tournament as the number 26 seed and will play Golovic in the first round. So no problem getting through in straights. Six love, six three. In the second round, she's taking on Townsend. And again, no problem getting through in straights. Six three, seven five. In the third round, she's taking on the qualifier Rousse, who just beaten Krajikova, the Wimbledon champion in the previous round. And after saving match points in the third, Bedosa would win in three, four, six, six, one, seven, six. In the fourth round, she'd take on Wong, who just beaten Azarenka and Sack along the way. This is no problem getting through in straights. 6-1-6-2 to advance to the quarterfinals. Navarro entered the tournament as the 13th seed and will take on Blinkover in the first round. This is no problem getting through in straights. 6-1-6-1. In the second round, she take on Rus, And again, no problem getting through in straights. 6-1-6-1. In the third round, she take on Kostruk, the 19th seed. And this was a battle. After splitting the first two sets, Navarro would get away with a third. 6-4-4-6-6-3. In the fourth round, she take on Goff, the third seed, who she'd played against at Wimbledon a couple of months ago with a good win. But this is a lot closer. With both players splitting the first two sets, but Navarro too strong in the end. 6-3, 4-6, 6-3 to advance to the quarterfinals. These two have only played the one time before. That was actually this year in Rome with Bedosa getting the win on the clay after coming back from a set down. So if it's going to be anything like that on a hard court with the American crowd going crazy, this should be an absolute epic. Bedosa's going to win this one. She's to keep her emotions in check. Of course, the crowd are going to be going for Navarro, especially after her win against Goff. The crowd are probably a little bit more educated on who Navarro is, especially the, the local crowd, of course. I think she's just going to keep her head, Bedosa, because if she does get a little bit annoyed that that's going to be happening and it does get a little bit overwhelming it could affect your game in a negative way if Navarro's going to win this one she just needs to keep doing what she's doing stay cool stay calm and also make Bedosa run she's been hustling so well this week Navarro especially against Goff she was playing so well on the defense if she can just make that defense work again and make Bedosa hit more shots and then also be aggressive and make Bedosa run when she gets the chance she could win this one very interesting matchup Bedosa maybe a lot of people thought would get this far but I think we all underestimated Navarro especially when she played Goff in that last match but I'm going to go with Navarro in this one I reckon Navarro is on some sort of a run here, and I reckon she might be able to make it to her first Grand Slam semi. It's going to be a close three-setter, I reckon, but let me know in the comments below who is making the semi.